district in downtown Kinston is closer to becoming a reality, joining other cities like Greenville and Washington. Tonight, News 12's Chris Young went to the special council meeting. It started earlier today. He joins us now live with an update. Chris, what are the next steps? Well, Val, within minutes, the city council voted unanimously to approve the social district. And now all that's left is approval from the ABC commission. The social district will be a six block area in downtown Kinston where people can eat and drink alcohol in public legally. City planner Elizabeth Blunt says the district comes with a few regulations. You can only do this during the hours that we have designated, which are going to be really Monday through Sunday, 10 a.m. to 11 p.m. There are boundaries. You have to remain in the social district boundaries. In addition to that, your beverage has to be in a designated cup which we have a logo, the time that it was sold to you, and the actual ABC permittee who sold it to you. Director of Downtown Kinston Revitalization, Leon Steele, says the city has worked with law enforcement, citizens, and the businesses in the upcoming social district. They've been to our public meetings, we've talked to them, they're aware of it, and they're supportive of it. While there has been a largely positive reaction, Blunt says this hasn't come with concerns from longtime Kinston residents. People are thinking that uh, participants may overindulge. Um, there may be more crime because of the alcohol inducing the boldness in people that they may not have had otherwise. But there has been no proof. The social district is slated to start up here on July 3rd, again with the only step left being approval from the ABC Commission. Live in downtown Kinston, I'm Chris Young with News 12.